So just a bit of background, I've been working on trying to reinstate a laptop. Um, some of those who know me uh, personally will know that I like the, uh, the idea of the repair manifesto. Um, it's not something I've attempted before. It's probably demanding more of my electronic skills than any of my robot stuff has so far. Um, which is what's going to make it fun and interesting. And frustrating, and there will be moments of banging heads against walls when it just doesn't work or I can't see what's going on. So, in this huge box, okay, there's a... We've got the first thing I'm going to need to be able to work with small stuff. A rather ridiculous amount of tape. Well, that's an interesting way to package things. That is plywood. So I've done a few surface mount things, like preparing those ESPs on their boards, but uh, I may occasionally need to do something a bit more serious than what I'm doing with my standard soldering iron. So this is a surface mount rework station. Um, basically, it's a hot air gun with a heater, um, and hopefully that means it's temperature controlled, multiple nozzles. So we've got a few different nozzle sizes there. So we've got an instruction manual, a bunch of soldering tools, which could be kind of useful, and a bunch of other soldering tools. So I suppose these are very tiny surface mount. These are for larger things, at the different tools, the different ends, with a nozzle changing tool. Various adapters. Oh, there we go. There is the actual business itself. So I bought this on Amazon. Um, it wasn't too expensive. Um, the brand is Yihua um, and it's a temperature control with a temperature readout on the front. Um, apparently there's a cowl button. The actual rework tool. Wow that is a beast. Obvious holes here that they clip into. Okay and there's three pips on the top there. These, This tool can now that's a bit tricky, and then you can do that, there we are, that's how you attach them, and I don't know if that is the smallest of the adapters, oh it certainly is, well anyway, so this should come in handy, um, means I can also rework some of those uh, ESPs if I decide to replace say the 12Es with 12Fs, something with more Wi-Fi reach, um, I'm sure there'll be more uses than just fixing a laptop. Um, having a surface mount rework station means I can seriously consider using a surface mount in my projects. Now, that doesn't mean I'm going to be abandoning doing stuff with breadboards, because actually for probably quite a lot of my watches, um, breadboards are just an easy way to prototype lots of stuff quickly. Um, so, majority of the, the work and certainly messing around and playing and fun is going to be with breadboards. But this means perhaps I can go and mount something onto, you know, there are breakout boards, so you can say take some surface mount, break it out to a dip package, as in a, a dual in line type pins for breadboarding, uh, and this means I'm capable of doing that. Um, there are also some cheeky hacks online for using uh, surface mount stuff on prototyping boards quickly, so I'll be investigating that, and uh, also using it to try and fix a laptop. 